Hi, St. Anthony families. Today's video is for peacemakers. So my current peacemakers, um, my junior peacemakers, which is third grade class, and for any sixth grade, upcoming seventh grade students who are interested in being a peacemaker next year. That is who this video is for. So first, I want to talk to my current peacemakers, um, to my seventh graders, Chloe and Jamie and Brooklyn. Um, you guys did an amazing job with your first year of peacemakers. Um, you guys always were willing to do anything I asked. You had great ideas. Um, you participated well in everything we've done. And I really appreciate your work. And next year, we're going to have um, just hit the ground running, right? And you guys are going to be the eighth graders. So you're going to be leaders. And um, I'm so excited to work with you guys in eighth grade. I know we didn't have as much time this year. But um, next year, we're going to hit the ground running with peacemakers. And I look forward to having another year with you guys. To my 8th graders, Toby and Mylesha and Logan, um, I'm going to try not to cry in this video, and you guys were um, such amazing peacemakers from the very beginning when I picked you at the end of 6th grade. Um, your leadership qualities are unparalleled. Um, you guys always stepped up. You did everything I asked you to do. You came up with your own ideas, super organized, kept me organized sometimes. Um, we did amazing things, big friends, big feelings, which I am going to try to implement again next year. I know we didn't have a chance this year. Um, Black History Month, Catholic Schools Week, Junior Peacemakers, um, different fundraisers, activities, um, decorating the hallway, putting up the posters. I mean, you guys did amazing things over the last two years. I will miss you terribly. Um, next year and in all the years to come. And I look forward to seeing what you're going to do in high school. Come visit. Um, and I just want to appreciate you guys. You're just an unparalleled group of peacemakers. And I will always appreciate the work you guys did. Um, junior peacemakers, you are my third graders. And we had a really good first junior peacemakers group, I think. Um, you're the first ones. You did great. Um, I think you, I hope you enjoyed all the activities that we did with junior peacemakers. Um, please remember what it is to be a peacemaker, right? Being a peacemaker, what does that mean? Well, we be kind to others. We be respectful. We be responsible. We solve conflicts in a way that is kind and respectful of other people. Um, and we just do the right thing, right? Even when no one's looking, we do the right thing. So great job, junior peacemakers, um, third grade. And I look forward to seeing you guys upstairs in fourth grade, right? Crazy. Um, sixth grade students who are interested in becoming a peacemaker for seventh and eighth grade. Normally, this would be the week that I pick peacemakers, this week and next week, um, but we can't really do that, can we? So I'm going to have to hit the ground running at the very beginning of next year. Um, Mr. Lamb and I will come into the class. We'll talk about um, Peacemaker Student Council and the differences in those. And then at that point, you can apply to be a peacemaker. Um, you know, we'll talk to, you know, we'll talk to staff and figure out um, exactly what we're going to do with peacemakers. So I think I'm taking four next year. That's my plan. Um, it's going to be an amazing class to pick from because you guys are just really a wonderful group of peacemaking students. So um, I'm super excited to work with um, some of you as peacemakers. And, you know, if you don't get selected as peacemakers, there's tons of opportunities. There's Express Yourself. There's Mr. Lamb's group. There's um, Student Council. There's Tech Team. There's Isadora. There's, you know, different ways to get involved. Um, so anyways. That is my Peacemaker video. I hope you have a great day and I'll see you soon. Bye.